What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. And before we get into today's video, I just want to say if you're a fan of those legends of the game, then I would definitely recommend subscribing to the channel. Also guys, if this is content that you enjoy, I would greatly appreciate it if you'd posterize that like button. And in the comments down below, I would love to see a legend you'd like to see me do a build on. Past or present, it doesn't matter. I'd be more than happy to do that build for you. And with that being said, let's get right into today's video. So guys, uh, where I'm doing newer players or, or players that are playing in today's NBA and are currently playing now, I really wanted to do a build on Luca simply because I think this guy, I think he, he you know, he's so talented. Um, he, he and he has the potential to take over the league one day. Um, but I mean, he's got a, you know, he's got a long way to go. I'm, I shouldn't say he's got a long way to go, but he's got he's got a lot of big names in front of him, right? I mean, I'm just not going to push him ahead of guys like, um, you know, like KD, LeBron, Giannis, you know, guys like that because well, they, they've been doing this for, for a while now. And don't get me wrong, Luka is great, and I really think that he's going to be, like I said, he's one of my favorite players. So I'm really, you know, I hope that he becomes a great player um, or a greater player, I should say, because he's already – pretty great as it is uh, but and I hope that he you know he leads Dallas to another ring kind of like Dirk did I really think that would be great and that would be really crazy guys you know that would be one of the few franchises that have been led actually wait that may be the only franchise that would have been led you know to the championship for multiple rings you know for different players that is I mean I know Houston with with Hakeem um, you know, I'm saying, you know, different players though. Um, so that would definitely be interesting to see. Yeah. And you know, I'm, I may be mistaken on that, but I, I think that may be the case. I'm not really 100% certain. I would need to fact check that to be 100% certain, but I think that may be the case, you know, and that would be pretty wild. I mean, uh, you know, I, I really don't know who won that the, uh, you know that uh, that specific uh, night on the trade uh, with Luca and Trey because well they're they're both really really playing very very well um, so they they you know they they're both doing well and uh, I just have to say though guys I mean Luca he is he's he's something amazing right um, now the pie chart that I would use for this guys is this one right here. The one that's a little bit more playmaking and a little bit less shooting. Um, now, you could go. Uh, don't get me wrong. I mean, you could definitely do this one as well. Um, I just did the playmaking one because, well, we're going to be 6'7". I want to have as good a ball handling as possible. Um, and we'll just go with speed on this. Um, we're just going to max out our close shot, our driving layup, and our driving dunk. And then we're going to max out our mid-range, our three-point shot, our free throw. And we're just, we're just going to basically, this is going to be a very offensive heavy build, guys. So we're going to max out everything um, in terms of like the, the shooting and the playmaking. Even though it's not necessarily, a, it may not necessarily be a part of uh, Luka's game. Um, we want this to be a really offensive heavy build. And, you know, Luca, while he's getting better at defense, I wouldn't say that he's an elite defender by any means. Um, so we're not going to focus too much on that. Um, but, yeah, this, I mean, look, once you get this build maxed out, guys, you're, you're going to have a decent defensive rating. It's not like you're going to be horrible. Um, we'll be 6'7", of course. Um, we can't go to 230. We'll go to 230. We'll go to 225. And then for the wingspan, guys, this is one of the few times that I'm actually going to bring this all the way in, okay? Um, just to help that, you know, ball handling and help the shooting a little bit. And, uh, I mean, if you look at the build, though, guys, I mean, you're going to have a close shot of 82. You're going to have a driving layup of 74, a driving dunk of 66, which with a Luka build, you're not really going to be worried too much about that. Um but what you what you are going to be using mainly is you're going to have a really good 87 mid range, you're going to have an 86 three point shot, you're going to have a nice post fade, which I know that that's 
you know, really not something that you should have on this build necessarily, or at least not that good. But it's going to be 91. Like I said, I just want this build to be very offensive heavy. Um, kind of like Luca is. I mean, he's a very offensive dominant player. Um, but he is, you know, he is getting somewhat better at defense, I, I would say. But I don't, I don't think he's quite there yet. Um, but you're going to have a really good 92 pass accuracy and a solid 85 ball handling. Um, but your defense, guys, I mean, if you look at it, look, it's not going to be hurt, horrible. You're going to have a 76 perimeter defense and a 76 lateral quickness um, with a uh, 70 defensive rebound and a uh, 51 offensive rebound. So you're not going to be a great defender by any means. You're not going to – would you – I mean, in 2K, you could definitely win the Defensive Player of the Year award with this build. But I'm just saying, in the real world, this build's not going to be a great defender, right? Um and that's fine. There's not a problem at all with that because you don't need that with the Luka build. Um, for the takeover, guys, I mean, it really depends on you. Um, I really like Playmaker, though. I really do. But I feel like Shot Creator is a really good one to go with on this build. And we have built a mid-range facilitator. And if you look at the very bottom shades of Luka Doncic, I, I always I always struggle saying that last name. I, I don't know why. It just it just does not roll off the tongue for me. But yeah, Luka is he, he's an amazing player, guys. Um, I really think I know a lot of a lot of people are saying you know that the NBA is in trouble after LeBron retires. But let's be real, guys. The the NBA is in good hands. Um, you know, you've got guys that that are very, very talented that's going to be doing very, very well for a long time. We're just going to do Acrobat for this one. For the shooting badges, guys, Hot Zone Hunter, Limitless Spot Up, uh, Difficult Shots, um, I would do stop and stop and pop on this one because you are going to be a point guard. Um, so that would be a good one. Now you could play this at small forward too if you wanted to, um, or shooting guard. I just like I just like playing it at point guard because well I I, I like you know I like for for it to feel like Luca, and Luca's not only a great shooter but he's also a really good facilitator. Things like that. So, and then for the last one, we'll do you know just really whatever you prefer. So we're gonna have blinders, dead eye, difficult shots, limitless spot up, hot zone hunter, and stop and pop all on gold. And I've also got set shooter and corner specialist on bronze. And then for the playmaking guys. I'm going to do unpluggable. I'm going to do tight handles, space creator, quick first step. Uh, needle threader is a good one on this. Um, you could do dimer. You could do floor general. Um, I like bullet passer. Uh, bailout is one of those that I always do like to have simply because, well, you just, you never know um, when you're going to get a bad animation and that kind of helps you out a little bit. So we're going to have Bullet Passer, Quick First Step, Space Creator, Unpluckable, Tight Handles, and Needle Threader all on Hall of Fame with Bell Out, Floor General, and Dimer on Bronze. And then for your one defensive badge, guys, I mean, it really it doesn't really matter. I'm just going to go Clamps because you are going to be a primary perimeter defender, and that's going to help you out a great deal. So, yeah, there you have it, guys. I really feel like this is a great Luka build. It's really fun to play with. Especially if you're someone you like shooting, you're going to enjoy this build a lot, I think. And uh, actually, I meant to do the, uh, the the last video, the Carlos Boozer video, um, yesterday. And, well, um, I'm actually, because I'm recording this, it's, it's Tuesday. Um, and I meant to put it out yesterday, but I have decided that I'm trying to do HD. And um, I switched. I switched over the the actual program that I use to 
uh, to edit. And for whatever reason, when I saved the video, it was just, it was gone. I couldn't find it anywhere. Um, it's somewhere out there, I guess. Somewhere maybe on my hard drive. I don't know. Um, but yeah, it, you know, it's one of those things. I'm, you know, it's a new program, so I'm, I'm trying to figure it out. Um, so, it, it, you know, it was one of those things, guys. Uh, you know, it's unfortunate that it happened, but where was a Monday and with work and everything, um, luckily today was a slow day at work, so I've had a little bit of time to do other things. Um, you know, so trying to just catch up, guys, and, uh, you know, hoping to make that video quality a little bit better for you guys um, and, you know, to grow this channel. I mean, that's really the, the main thing. I, you know, I really want to, you know, get people that may not have seen, you know, some of the older players uh, to start viewing the videos. Maybe they'll start watching some of those older videos, and that's one of the main reasons why I'm doing modern players now as well. You know, and let's face it, I mean, the players that I'm doing builds on that's modern, unless they were like a request, um, they're going to go down as some of the greatest that's ever played the game, right? So it's not like, you know, they're not going to be legends. They're going to be legends, in, you know, in the future. Um, some are already going to, you know, already considered legends like LeBron. I mean, but yeah, you know, just, just uh, guys, if you like the video, I'd greatly appreciate it if you'd leave a like. If you haven't done so already, guys, I would definitely recommend subscribing to the channel. This is all I focus on is doing builds on actual NBA players and legends. And in the comments below, guys, if there's someone you would like to see me do a build on, past or present, superstar, role player, bench warmer, it doesn't matter. I'll do that build for you. And with that being said, guys, have a wonderful day, night, evening, wherever you are. Have a good one.